Hello everybody, welcome back to more Enter the Gungeon. Robot into the Gungeon for... A nor... Eh, I don't know. You know what? Nah, let's go crazy. What are we doing today? We're doing a cursed run. I just decided last second here. What are we gonna do about stealing? We're not gonna do it. We're gonna remember not to steal stuff. We're gonna remember not to pick up cursed items, and we're not gonna spawn the Lord of the Jam. So, you know what? He sucks. He's he's real real annoying. Instant <laughs> instant loss. Like you have to have a crazy crazy run. Oh my. Okay. And even with a crazy crazy run, he just he sucks. You know, he he really sucks. And he's almost like not even f fun to have chasing you. I mean, like. I know that that's kind of the point. If he was, if it was fun, then it wouldn't be a, a, a punishment, you know, for for taking so many cursed items or, or getting cursed or whatever. It's a challenge. He's, you're not supposed to want him to chase you. <laughs> Did you see that? He like just, oh man, he laser sight got me there. Right, at, right as soon as he moved. Behind the scenes. Oh, okay, that kind of is lame. Behind the scenes. Thing. I have not played Gungeon for like, you know, let's just do that for now. Uh, for like a week or so. Hey there, man. You can have that. Because I am back from vacation. That's right. Ooh, I was on vacation. You didn't even know. It's because I, I played a whole lot of Gungeon. And, and I did all my recording like a long, like a, a week or so ago. And I just, I haven't been, uh, haven't been playing Gungeon. So hopefully I'm not too rusty. At, like, hopefully that one hit was truly a... a as much of a fluke as it kind of looked like it was. That guy no-scoping me like that. But, yes. So I haven't really, I haven't been playing any, whoa, anything other than the Nintendo Switch. Speaking of, I'm really excited for Gungeon. I wish Gungeon would have been out, you know, if Gungeon would have been out on Switch, uh, that would have been really nice. But, alas, I have not, I have not played. Interesting. I might just go for the battle standard to like try. Mm. I could try to go for Junkin. That could be good. Could be good. I don't know. I mean, we got that chest up there to break. We did kind of like do that run. I mean, I know that whatever we get is going to be random, but we did kind of do that run already. Where we get all the junk as robot, because I mean, all the junk does give you the bonus uh, damage up. Let's, you know what? Let's break this. Let's break it. Give me junk. Give me junk in, even. Nope, that's okay. We get a 5% damage up because we're a robot and we got junk. That's just a hit hidden synergy not everybody knows about. Hey. So apparently, battery bullets gives you a dam or uh, an accuracy up. Shocks of troops of the hegemony of man consist entirely of heartless machines shielded from bolt voltage attacks. Their victims, however, have learned this learned to fear the inevitable sting of their electrified shells. Electrifies all bullets fired. Yes, of course. How could I not know that that is an accuracy up? Hmm. I mean, I don't I guess at this point I don't know if it's true. I'm just I'm inclined to believe it. I'm a I'm a simple man. I, I hear it, I believe it. Probably not a great, uh, great quality. Boop, boop, boop. If they, I mean, it, that would be really, really nice because then robot automatically starts with an accuracy upgrade, kind of like a, a way to make all guns better. Kind of like, uh, kind of like the Marine. Huh. That would that would change everything I've ever known. Cause that that would be maybe like enough to make him just like make his health justify No, no, I I still think he's like I still think he's the weakest character. Uh in, in a game that's all about not whittling a, yourself away, having health that cannot be replenished easily is kind of a, a deal breaker when it comes to strength. Oh, come on. 
I think, I mean, maybe if he had something that increased, like, his damage on every gun, then he'd it would balance it out. But I, I kind of like that he is a tougher character. He's a more challenging character. Um, we do have a, you know, it's less annoying to do curse, like, have cursed enemies as a robot, though. You don't take the, uh, the double damage. You still have to deal with their double or triple, triple health and their faster movement speed, etc. But I find that, you know, the damage is kind of, kind of the annoying part. You, can, you know, you can take half as many hits if you're, uh, you know, you're losing red hearts. Got. I'm feeling actually like I'm, I'm feeling pretty decent right. Hey, uh, e, uh, e, uh, e, gotta make a choice, gotta make a choice, sure. Hey, happy I did. That is nice. That is definitely better than, uh, better than junk. The real conflict is if I should buy Battle Standard to kind because it's, a, Battle Standard with followers is really good. But should I bank on the f fact that we might get followers? Probably not. Not, that's not a, a wise decision. But what else is here? Shield is probably a wise decision. We can do that and get something else still. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna fight the boss. Should we get the plague pistol? Try to force a... Hmm. Try to force a, a passive item to drop. This robot standard is really good. You know what? I, ca I haven't used the pike pistol in a while. It can benefit from some accuracy. If that's true. We'll just, give, we'll just give it a shot. You know, is it the smartest idea? Maybe not. But, you know what? I forgot about that. Um, piercing bullets plus poison. Ah, that was an unnecessary blank for sure. Plus poison is really handy. Because you can kind of stack the poison a bit. I need to reposition myself so bad. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. Am I hitting him over there? Is he poisoned? I think he is. He's not getting poisoned at all. Is this one immune to poison? That'd be... I shouldn't have done that, but eh, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. All right, so we get the shield... From the A, okay. We got a gun anyways, but you know what? I'm pleased with it. Okay, so. Is this truly an accuracy of the battery bullets? Because it seems a little bit more accurate than 180 degrees. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think it's a tiny tiny accuracy up because usually it's a, it's a hundred degrees it fires it you know like I don't know how to phrase it but I think you might know what I mean mm. it's it's probably dumb battle standard doesn't do anything it won't do anything if we don't get a follower uh, I think we maybe just buy the key and call it a day we might not even need the key but let, let's do it. Let's do the, the key. Call it a day. Go down to the next floor. Good. So, actually, ooh. Crown of Guns plus Ghost Bullets. That's handy. That's a lot handier than I would have even, like, I, I didn't even think about it. That's really nice, actually. Ooh, that's really nice. Okay. I'm very pleased. Ah, uh, I'm always pleased when we can get Crown of Guns, but... That's gonna be so nice for room clear. So nice. Die faster. What is the chance? What is the actual chance to... Um poison somebody. It doesn't seem super high. 
Eh, or maybe maybe it's around 50. I don't know. I, I should I should probably know that that statistic. Probably does change per gun though, I guess. Ooh. E no. Usually usually with you you know, like a, a poison weapon or something like that, you can get that guy in in a one cycle pretty simply. Not today. Not today. Potion of gun friendship is interesting. Especially with robots, since his normal gun is good. Because you don't have to worry about the ammo loss. I think it's worth it. I think it's worth it. Let's try this. Ooh! That knockback is, is insane, though. The best, yeah, yeah, the best thing to do with it is if you can have your basic shots be good, but, you know, they kind of are right now, because we got piercing shots and we got robot, whoop, robot's gun, which is better than most. What did I get hit by, a bouncy shot? It must have been a bouncy shot, that sucks. Boop, oh, no, 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 no. All right. Okay, not not doing too bad. I'm, I'm feeling like a little rusty, but all things considered, we're doing all right. Whoop. Who's... Oh, okay. I will... I'll fill this up. Smart choice? I don't know. Probably not. Whoop. I think we save it for, uh, you know... I think there's going to be obvious situations where that the crown of guns works better. This room is not one that really makes. I think it's like, yeah, like a situation like the, another jammed version of this guy. I can go like three runs without seeing one of these. We got two of them and they're both jammed. Ignoring that. Okay. Let's go to the chest over here, I guess. Get more info. Hey. What are all the letters that those do? I, I wonder if that's, like, if they spell anything out. If you, you know, you put them together in the right way. I don't know what, it, it would have to be. Of a pun, I wouldn't it would have to be like read or something like that. It's just not really a pun, it's just wordplay. Piercing bullets, losers! That would have been really nice, uh, really nice showing for my crown of guns. Ah, well. It has, I have too good to use syndrome with it right now, but it's like, I don't know, crown of guns is weird because it's like, unless you get a little bit of more of an accuracy upgrade, it's actually not that good. It's like pretty good. It's very, very, very fun. It's pretty good, very fun. Okay. I see you. I see you. You mimic. Let's just get him with that, and you're jammed. Huh. Waiting for the perfect time. You can really use that as kind of like a bullet time. It's a little, it's, okay, it's more than a little cheesy. Please don't go by the pit. You know what? We're going to activate this for the knockback. Stay in that corner. This is the biggest letdown possible. We're robot. This does not heal us, does it? Let me, let me look it up. I, I'm pretty sure it does not. Because, oh man, that, that would be really, because it's like the bet, one of the better items in the game. It does increase your coolness, it says. Does it? Doesn't say it does anything for robot. So you know what, we'll just take it. There we go. We'll use it 
for the coolness. That is a big old bummer. Because, you know, like, in a game kind of, you know, a little, a little bit about attrition. Well, a decent amount about attrition. Why did I do that? Uh, that was so dumb. It, it's a decent amount about attrition and having an item that practically doubles your health pool near the end of the game. That's kind of huge. We're just gonna keep on using the plague pistol. I'm, I'm glad I bought it. It makes things a decent amount better. Hey! Everybody get poisoned, don't you dare blow me up. This is not working so great. Okay, yeah, see, that's, that's kind of the downside to the Potion of Gun Friendship. You, you really gotta have them in like a corner. Otherwise, they're just, you're gonna lose them. They're gonna be gone. Bow, 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 bow. Come on. <laughs> you are so slippery. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. What? Oh my god. You suck. He <laughs> jumped right into my face. I don't know, maybe Plague Pistol is not doing... I, I, I find it hard to believe. The Piercing Poison is really nice together. Hmm. Is there a gun chest? Right? Yeah, it's a gun chest. I'll, I'll blow it up. Brown chest guns. Not typically great. I'd rather take a 5% damage up. And a possibility for Junkin. Not that we could use the battle standard anymore, but, you know, it's a possibility. Uh, like, Jun Junkin is awesome. He he's really good. As he should be. You know what? Ghost bullets are gonna be nice for this. Huh? Yep. Oh my! This is really dangerous, and it's not even that good. I shouldn't be using Crown of Bullets for... Yeah! For this fight. At least... Not when there's... No ads out. I gotta switch to the other side real bad. Please wait to do your laser until I clear one out. We got the misfortune of having a jammed ad of his. Ah, uh, that's risky. There we go, there we go, there we go. Just go for him. Focus on him. Ads, they don't die, but they basically, basically don't. You know what, Barrel is really pretty decent. In general, I'm extra decent with Robot. Gets the built-in synergy with the battery bullets to kind of leave a little, the little electrified puddles. You know what, we're gonna be swimming in money because of cursed mode, so. Cursed mode and having shields. Uh, if I've explained it a whole lot. <laughs> Both of those things, you know, that's all you need to know. Both of those things do help get you more money. Hmm. Plague pistol and barrel could work together nicely to take enemies out over time. Does this, does it work quite as well as I remember? Actually, yeah, sorta. If you can get them into a wall or whatever. Otherwise, you're kind of just pushing them, you're pushing them out of the pool. Also, are the fish not piercing? Oh, okay, they are. Ooh. I would kind of like to have my bullets not push so much. But I really like that we have these shots that are going through enemies and have a chance to stun. That's beautiful. Can't be poisoned. Okay. 
Should we bother with this room? Sure. Hey. Hi, buddy. Um... Abyssal, eh, Abyssal Tentacles actually not as good as it seems. It, it seems so good. Like, I can't believe it. That was so bad. I was just looking. <laughs> I was not looking at that guy. I was looking at the uh, oh, the other ones coming from the left. Uh, Abyssal Tentacle, it seems really good. But it's one of those items that's so cool. And you kind of get a little bit blinded by how cool it is. Um, and... I don't know. It just it runs out of ammo so fast. Should we just open this? Yes. You know what? We're low on health. And we don't want to be pushing enemies that much anyways. Should we get the... You know what? Okay, that's fine. Fine trade. It was a secret room. What do I say? <laughs> we, we need to... Uh, I, I think I've lost a couple tangents here. But... We need the survivability from the Ring of Ethereal Form. And Abyssal, Abyssal Tentacle is not that awesome because it runs out so quickly. There. I, I know that those were things I was talking about. I can't remember if I wrapped them up. I'm still getting back into the swing of a recording. I've been, like I said, I've been gone. I've been gone a while. I haven't talked to myself in a, in a, a <laughs> decent amount of time. It's something that you wouldn't think you'd forget how to do. But, yep. I don't know. Should I... Use my brain? No. This room has the potential to be annoying. Anything that really has these walkways that you sometimes have to walk on can get really annoying. Because the game's all, all about mobility and, you know, getting where you need to go while dodging bullets. And if you don't have very much, very, uh, a very big path, uh, he 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 he, then, uh, you're more likely to be hit. That's simple. Uh, okay. junk thank you yeah I'm, I'm thank you whoever i can't it's can't remember who told me but thank you for telling me that if you talk to them a couple times as a robot you do get something it's not like a it's not a as good as a full health heal but you do either get a bottle or a, a junk piece of junk and in that situation i think we got the thing the better of the two things oh my god no that was just all right all right, guys. All right, guys. Let's get that brain back on. Let's get get that brain going again. It was it's it's here. I know it is. God, I'm being so risky for no reason. We have the ring of ethereal form. We should use it when I I feel threatened. Those fish down there are tricking me. I actually, don't feel super threatened here. Now I feel a little friend. Come on, man. Oops. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, do not steal anything. I won't. I'm not gonna steal it. I'm not gonna steal it. I'm just looking. I'm just looking. Sunglasses suck. Actually, wait. They increase your coolness. They increase your coolness. And we have a survivability item on our space bar, so increased coolness actually goes a long way. That means, increased coolness means we can use our space bar more item, and, or, wow, our space bar item more often. And since it makes us invincible, it seems like a pretty smart idea, I guess. Just need to stop playing so dang bad. That's all we need to do. Just need to dodge the bullets, as they say. All right, I'm not gonna go in there without Ring of Ethereal Form being charged up. Cause this could be, I don't know. It could be Treadnought, which is very annoying. Okay, we also yeah, get that slow down. I, I don't know that that's necessarily a benefit though. The slowdown on the explosions from sunglasses. Not sure that it's gonna help us, but 
maybe I can get used to it and we can use it to our advantage. Ah! <laughs> oh, God. Okay, donezo. I'm loving the piercing bullets. What else have we gotten that's been awesome? I mean, chronic guns is nice. But we just, I don't know. Like, the more I think about it, the less I'm noticing, like, valuable times to use it. Like, if, if we could get another accuracy up, we could kick some serious rump. Let's get the barrel. But until then, I think it's just like, it's, it's a little bit too much of a spread to be worth it on average. Are you a mimic? You're a mimic. That's rude. Stay. Stay. No. No. What a bad gun. That, that really sucks, to get this out of a golden chest. Does it do, like, more damage based off of your money or something, at least? Like, maybe there could be a smart time to use it. All right, I'm ready to use my space bar whenever I feel like I might be in danger. I, feel, I, I felt like I was in danger there, but I didn't even do it. Glad I didn't. Okay. You know what? Let's just use it. We can't poison him, right? No, but since we're inside of him, we can do this. You know what? That's really handy. In a way. Oh, I'm stuck! Oh, God, you got to be joking! I got stuck right at the end of it. Oh, my. This is not my day. Not my gungeon day. Everybody hurts. Sometimes. Nope! Don't you dare... Die to tread not. I will not allow it. Okay. Dang, I'm mad. Syringe. Man, they're giving us such sucky luck to balance out the crazy luck I had on the last run. Last run was absurd. You know what? We're going to get Skull Spitter. Like, we just need something else. I should have probably brought... Oh, no, I should have bought the membrane. What am I thinking? Oh, that's so dumb. Membrane is definitely better than Skull Spitter. Maybe we can... I don't know. Maybe not, though. Maybe we can use the Skull Spitter from safety and, you know, like, not die because of it. That'd be pretty cool. We just need to start dodging the bullets. I'm gonna take a second here. I'm gonna go. There we go. Maybe that's all we needed to do. Just needed to shake it off. All right, let's do this from safety here. And by safety, I mean not necessarily in safety. There we go. This is better. They're not gonna really. Oh, come on. They're not really going to have a chance to hit me from there. Oh, you know what? It's not even working that great. It's not, a, it's not as homing as I was thinking when I purchased it. Alright. Pretty displeased with my purchase. Would not recommend. All right, you know what? Ring of Ethereal Form is working pretty well with this. Because we can kind of just, like, literally get inside of their character model. You know what? Actually, now that I remember, Plunger is not bad anymore. I forgot. Plunger's okay now. Because it puts the poison at their feet. And they balanced it out to make it a little bit better. That way. 
Come on, you gotta die. Come on, you gotta die. Just have one, one shield. I feel no pressure, though. I feel totally fine, because nobody would possibly call me bad. Right? Just because a uh, uh, one run after not playing, <laughs> not playing for a while, nobody could possibly uh, call me bad. All right. Uh oh. That was really bad. Ah. We got uh, a couple blanks we could use here. Make this a whole lot easier for ourselves. But alas, I would have to be not bad. Hmm. We're actually doing all right now. Oh, that was pretty risky. <laughs> okay, so this room, the little guys might spawn up and surprise me. I'm just trying to keep my brain ready for any possible surprises here. I think the little zombie ones might show up over here. Nope, we're good. Nothing happened. All right. If I could get a shield, that'd be great. We haven't been getting a ton. I mean, not that I should have lost all of the shields that we lost, but all things considered, we haven't been getting it. We haven't been getting a lot of help. I see that key guy, but you know what? He's not top priority. We have plenty of keys. I wasn't gonna move out of my way and possibly risk my life for him. Oh, got an explosion there. Be careful. That's all you need to do. Just be careful. I have my space bar, but I, I just really want to save it. And, and that's so dumb, like, to, to never use your space bar item. If it's good like this. You know what we're going to do, though? We're going to switch to the crown of guns. Put on the ring. Oh, that was... I waited a little bit longer than I should have. Okay, okay. Bye, loser. Okay, what to fill? Now that we kind of got the uh, Ring of Ethereal form synergy going, I'm thinking it might be the better thing to fill. But, oh my god. What do we need? We need... Shields! We need to live! Everybody walk through the electricity. One by one! Oh, this feels like a zombie survival map on something. Bring it. Bring it! One fish, two fish. Red fish, oh! Blue fish is save my life! Okay. I'm going to fill the barrel up. It's actually our best weapon right now. What a world. I used to think the barrel was bad, but look look at the chance to stun. It's actually really high. It's so good. It does pretty decent damage. It has piercing bullets because of ghost bullets. Um, and the electricity works very well with robot. It's just... I used to... I was sleeping on the barrel so much because it just seems like a trash tier gun, doesn't it? You know? I, I really think it does. But, it's not. Uh. Please, stun. Stun. Oh, God. Thank you, stun. Don't you split. Ah, uh, you split. Okay, another blank is nice to play around with. A shield would be great, though. Okay, we got a some kind of special room here. You know what? Give it to me. Disarmed. No! My barrel! I was just thinking them. Okay. Well, at least uh, got a hell of a lot of. They increased the max cap for all my guns, though. Except for, obviously, microtransaction gun, because that's not based off of that. I mean, that's nice and all, but it was our best gun, so dang. And it didn't even fill them up, it just increased their max cap. Oh man, we're screwed. 
We're screwed. I see you. Stay. I don't even care if we have to use a lot of the ammo. It's just... You gotta be careful. I would love if you dropped a shield over an item. I don't even care. I'd prefer it. Casey, we can't. We can't. We can't. Unless we feel like being... Uh, okay, well, we, we lost our chance to even... To be stupid. But, you know, sometimes... The smartest thing to do is to be stupid. Not today, though, but obviously. I was definitely thinking about it, I'll admit. Back to the Plague Pistol, I expose. This guy can't even be poisoned, though. Yeah, I just... I, I'm not... I'm not pleased. Not pleased with the... Daisuke. Outcome. Eh. I was just fully expecting to see, like... Fortified or whatever. Man, that's annoying. There's no shields in here. Can't help but notice. There's no shields. Uh, you know what we're gonna do, though? You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna munch the microtransaction gun and something else. What's the thing that we're gonna munch? Probably plunger. Maybe the skull spitter. The skull spitter is a higher tier. Because here's the thing. you The gun you get is based off of the tiers of the guns you put in. So... We might get a good one out. Okay. Okay. Old Goldie is pretty good. <sighs> Man. Old Goldie is pretty good. Especially if we truly do have better accuracy. Um, whatever. I think we just gotta roll with this. I think we just gotta go in... Hope for the best. Hey, oh, I th think we got the best possible outcome. We just need to wait a smidge. Yes! No, this is not going quite as good as I was hoping. Not at all. Okay, we got one. All right, that could have gone a lot better. That could have gone a lot better. But you know what? It could have gone a lot worse. We were sitting at one shield for a long time, and I didn't take a hit. So I'm going to chalk that up to rustiness. Rustiness, indeed. I could have picked an easier character to come back to, but whatever. That's not my style. That's my, not my style. When, if things are easy and monotonous, like, you know, if you can predict every outcome, it's kind of... You know, it loses a little bit of the flavor. I'm glad I, st I still suck some sometimes, you know? Just a guaranteed win every single time. I was getting kind of sick of it. I'm glad we had a terrible, terrible run mixed in there. But hey, either way, uh, next episode is going to be a modded run. We're going to get back to that. But that is going to do it for today. Thank you, buddy, for watching. I greatly appreciate all the... Uh, inevitably nice comments you were going to leave <laughs> on this video and all the ones that you left up to this point thank you thank you see you next time